Curtis did say slick roads out there, potential for them and to the west snow covered roads and roadside assistant companies say they're ready to lend a hand during this snowy weather. But due to the pandemic, there are some changes to how they provide that service. KCCI's Kayla James joins us downtown with what you should know, Kayla. Yeah, Rhea, I spoke with a few companies, one local and one who provides services across the nation. They tell me they're still 24 seven, but there are some new COVID-19 rules that they've set for their own companies. AAA is one of those companies. Their roadside assistance team is ready to go. But if a vehicle needs to be told, the people are not allowed to ride the AAA driver. AAA says instead they're helping rearrange a ride for people if it comes to towing, but their first priority is getting vehicles back up and running. We also spoke with Elite Express Towing here in Des Moines. They tell us not much has changed. They're still letting people ride with them if needed. Drivers are wearing masks though, and it's a courtesy the team hopes will be followed by people they help. Keep your mask on and st stay away from people pretty much. Our, our trucks are cleaned every day. And of course, these changes are temporary and they're depending on the pandemic. Other companies I spoke with say they want to do everything in their power to help people feel safe during this time. In Des Moines, Kayla James, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. Public works teams across the metro area have undergone a few internal changes this year because of the coronavirus pandemic, but they say it won't change how they care for the roads this winter. KCCI stopped by the Windsor Heights Public Works Department this afternoon. The team is divided into groups to prevent any type of COVID-19 spread. Employees are wearing face coverings and they're also making sure to disinfect the trucks after each trip. But if COVID-19 were to impact the team, the city's public works director says they have a backup plan. We are covered. We have a contractor that has agreed to come in and perform snow removal operations for us on a time and materials basis. So we will be covered. It's, it, it's you know, we got all of our bases covered. Ankeny's Public Works Department has a one person per truck rule. Waukee's team has people assigned to their own trucks. Like Windsor Heights, both cities are also thoroughly disinfecting the trucks.